Hello everybody, Dick Fick here, and welcome to our playthrough of Elden Ring on a Dex build character. We're going to be starting off as a wrench. I think the keepsake I should usually go is Golden Seed. I don't actually know what the best would be here. Got Dick Fig DXLP is the name. I already did a little bit of the customization off screen just because make this go a little bit faster for intro. Let's get right into this. I have played like a quarter of the way through the game before, so uh, it'll be interesting nonetheless. Haven't done a dex build yet. Anything? We have blackness. And the music hits. There's a light bulb sound. The fallen leaves tell a story. Shattered. Who did it? Who broke the Elven Ring? Come on, guys. In our home, across the fog, the lands between. This guy sounds grizzled. Now, Queen Marika the Eternal is nowhere to be found. Is she dead in the underground somewhere? And in the night of the Black Knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Some assassins going on? Soon, Marika's offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards. I didn't realize she was a daughter. The mad taint of their newfound strength triggered Nasty. shattering. Literally just a sneaky in someone's brains. A war from which no lord arose. A war leading to abandonment. By the greater will. Oh, rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Desperate times, desperate measures. Just res a random dude. Chieftain of the Badlands. The ever brilliant gold mask. Fear. Dramatic. Bad companion. The loathsome dung eater. And Sir Gideon Ophnir. The all-knowing! Okay. Yeah, we, got, we got some story building here. I think I skipped all the stuff from my other playthroughs. Apparently if I move right, green screen gets all janky over here. Interesting. And one other whom Grace would again bless. Mm. A tarnish. Of no, no renown. Yet. Not yet, but my name will be known through the land. Stigfig Dex. The LP. To the lands between. To stand before the Elden Ring. A little bit of foreshadowing. Like, do they actually think the player's and that good? And become the Elden Lord. The devs should know their own game and be like, eh, maybe he'll become an Elden Lord. Because, like, most people don't play all the way through Dark Souls games. Gotta get rolled. Well, what's up with the green screen today? It's been a little bit weird. The ring. If I remember correctly, there isn't really much to explore in this area. Ooh, that candle exploded loudly. 
finger. I'm gonna have some issues because my key bindings don't quite work. Okay, it took a second there to do some settings, change it to non full screen, change my keyboard profile over to my key bindings for this game. And uh, let's go get Rickrolled by this gentleman. I am pretty damn sure no one has found anything in the starter area. It's worth anything. Pretty damn sure. Is there any reason not to two hand? Probably not. Let's do this, you little shit. The odds of me beating this guy are zilch to none. Not that good at the game. Usually do a little bit better than that versus that guy, but so be it. Still have no idea what happens if you actually beat him at the beginning. But uh, that is Dark Souls introduction to get rolled and be okay with dying. Like dying is just part of the game and you need to accept it. This is a nice little like tutorial intro. Two parts. Okay. Now I'm a naked dead guy. Another naked dead, deader than dead guy. I guess they never really explain how you get from up there to here, do they? Question mark? I don't really know. Oh, is this the elk thing? No, it's your mount. Don't worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. We found him here, after all. Interesting. I've really never watched his cutscenes, apparently. And if I did, I do not pay attention during my live stream. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. I mean, if you keep implanting that, I should seek the Elden Ring. Maybe I will seek the Elden Ring. Violate the Golden Order. Hit the puppy real quick. So we're waking up now. So they have the whole cup in the hand in a cup of water thing to make yourself pee yourself if you're sleeping. Do you think my guy peed himself? Nice ass he's got though. I will admit that. Hurry back though. But nice ass. Okay, you awake now, buddy? Sweet flask of tears and mana. I'm pretty freaking sure my key bindings for pot is there. Pretty sure. Keyword is the pretty sure part. Tutorials down here, I know, okay. Cave of knowledge lies below. So everyone was missing it. I don't know if it's worth doing this or not on a new character. Like, do you actually get enough souls or gear to be quote unquote worth it? Do you get anything down here? It's like, I don't actually need to read any of these. But like the full clear part of me just kind of has to do this and I'm not sure why I don't want to guard I don't have a guarding weapon oh shit one shot the other guy but not that guy okay so these lives like this this let's play it's not a live stream it's a let's play Try not to cuss too much. Keep myself under control. Did someone just... Oh, yeah, this is right. This is the room with archer materials for crafting. This game is amazing. My mouse just went off to my left screen. Pause. 
You'd be my first shield guy. How to lock on. You're gonna do a stabby stab? I will heavy break you then. Nope, won't heavy break you. There we go. It's dead. It's dead. Blech. Should have added my one seed to my flasks before I came down here. Jump it. If you attack and don't light attack on him. Look at these samurais and stuff. Like, oh, uncalled for, buddy. Missed. Shh. Totally overkill. So far, no items though, and no one's dropped anything. So I think you're safe to skip this. Yes, I know about my barbaric roar. Teach me how to use my abilities. Crouching. Sure, I'll crouch. Hey, buddy. How's it going? You digging for a plant? Mm. Just double hard kidney shots with a giant club for no reason on that poor guy. Whoa! Oh, whoops. Critical strikes are a little overkill for this. Not exactly needed. Could this be a checkpoint? No. I was curious if you could crouch through there, though. Stance breaking, hold control, control while jumping to jump attack. We down. We continue on. These statues are alternative spawn points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guard counters. Okay, he got out of range there. Hmm. I was thinking that jump attack would stagger him. So. How do I do that in single player? This is all single player. In my own game, my other characters. So what happened there is I hit R to use a pot and I used my mana pot. Because... My items were not in the right spot or on the right screen. Can you double equip pots? I put mana pots here in my game. That's why that was so wrong. All right, well that's embarrassing. You figure Rick roll by the first little boss here in the tutorial zone. Because you don't have your pots on your bar. Here are my souls back, you son of a bitch. It's usually more how the fight goes. But Dark Souls has this whole thing where sometimes you go too aggro and it gets you rickrolled, and sometimes you don't go aggro enough and it gets you rickrolled, and there's like this nice little balancing point how much aggro you can deliver to the enemy to be most effective. That also depends on how you're playing. Let's go and seed old trees. So many trees. Also, I'm going to have to settle my passwords and stuff. Oh, it needs all of these things everywhere. Through the door. Pretty sure there was nothing in that room. Down there is a higher level zone. Help some friends kill that on another playthrough. Cooperative multiplayer. Co 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 co. Fingers. Tarnished finger. Over yet? I wonder if there is a thing below this. Oh, look like it. Almost got squashed there. Got a camera view down there. Huh. Line that up perfectly with my cock. That's right, everyone. We said cock. Moving on. 
door opens message there. You know, I've got this old cup of water. An older cup of water, because I need to bring cups over to the other side of the house. I just dropped a paper towel on the puppy's ass. Wife just texted me, she's awake. This is my fresh water. Take a little drink break. And now you have the second tutorial boss, which is just a little night guy right there. Off in the distance. Is she beatable? Come to the I've seen people do it. I ain't gonna spend six hours doing it, that's for damn sure. Me. Are you familiar? You may all that is the gun. Mm. It will leave even if it leaves. So I went back into my guide video mode there, where you just button mash through this stuff. He's basically telling me that this beam of lights here, this, you can see the little ash thing, is what I'm supposed to follow? What is that? I don't know, but it goes that way. It takes me to the church, and you can see it on the map here. It's basically, oh, you can't see it on the map. Okay, dig fig making shiz up. By the way, once you sleep at this count, this grace. I'm gonna try and start calling these graces, cause like my Dark Souls, like just it's natural for me to call them bonfires, but they're not bonfires. You can see the golden thing there is what he was talking about. And he's basically telling me about Godric and all that kind of nonsense. But you guys, pretty sure nothing around back there. Well, I can touch this thing. Yes, yes, yes. Do the things. Activate the statue. I bet if I even come punch this fucker in the head, he would murder me. What you got, big boy? Oh, run away! They got shit on me, big boy. Stamina for days. I'm hoping this church is a safe from him. But I don't actually know. I know he does have a despawn mechanic, so that's a whole sitch. Okay, we got fast grace, introduces me to fast travel. You're and I can also let you're not then why not? I am Carly. I am Carly. Fine for goods. About Carly. Of a nomadic people. Selling wares as I travel. The land has been tainted by madness since the shattering of the Elden Ring. It's only tarnished like yourself, who keep things from drying up entirely. Let's say you're a very welcome customer. Well, I appreciate you know, it. If you can spare them, you should buy yourself a crafting, crafting kit. Special. The kit costs a bun, but the imp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Purchase. I mean, do I just listen to him? Sure. My torch as well. Well, thank you. I do appreciate it. Item crafting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strength and armaments. Got you. Smithing stone. Could just make my life easier and plus one this. Oh, wait. We don't have the runes to do so. Okay. Moving on. Kind of want some armor. Oh, this whole naked thing ain't my jam, but I do like the stat allocation. Oh, yeah! Beat down. Should be two or three more this way, right? And then there's some more off to the right. There's usually one guy pathing, one guy sitting at a campfire. If you guys want to draw me a weapon or something, I'm not going to argue. It would be kind of nice. Oh, hey, buddy. What's up? I'm to a pig. There's a little dungeon back there off to the left. We'll have to clear that. But first, let's get the mount going. Up you all. Just a health one. No one wants a health one. Still, you know, I took the golden seed, haven't allocated it. 
it's kind of bad on my part. If I die here, there's a statue to respawn at, so it's not a big deal fighting these guys. And I could just bypass them and go get my mount. Ow. This is what we call blow for blow. But I win. Just the uh, lazy man's way of playing Elden Roll. Elden Roll? Elden Ring? Elden Roll. Why did I just say Elden Roll? That's so random. Get one down. Our little Warhammer's actually got some decent speed to it, so you need to watch that shit. Covered in blood here. Rune fragment. This should be whetstone or something of that nature over here. Can we get to it this way? Should also be like double wolves and to do with the warhammer. Totally dead. I did not respect the wolves at all. Ah, uh, you know, you play your high-level characters a lot, and this is the shit that happens. Cause like all my other characters, I could walk up to that group and just, just stomp them. Ugh. Ah, you gotta adjust your play to level one. Level one. Try that again. Maybe a little different tactic this time. I'm in through, move aside. Oh, you tagged me with that. Your range is a little bit, oh shit, stuck on a wall. Coming down. So we can't funnel them. Oh shit. Well, I didn't exactly want to just bypass them all and open this, but I mean, I'll do it. Take the loot and run. I'm gonna find a place to put my cup. My cup's hitting my mouse. It's got too many cups to my right. Ash of War Stomp, Whetstone Knife. I knew there was something down there, so that lets me put things on weapons. With him and he dropped loot. Heal up, though. So how many do I have here? I'd love to delete the wolf. Oh, fail jump. You know, Dig, you don't have to go blow for blow with every shield guy you fight. There's alternative methods. What? That wasn't a critical. Okay. Well. <sighs> scrubs will be scrubs. But you first will. That range on the damn spear! If I go too far, there's sometimes bats over here. Okay, shield guy. Fuck you. Really, that didn't- it was a heavy charge attack. Okay, so that shield hit can hit you when you're in a hard rotate around. I'm gonna die to this guy. Because I can't shield break him with heavy attacks. Why? They're charged heavies times two into shield. Didn't kill him. <sighs> Scrub a rubber dub dub in the tub. Need like a rubber ducky up in here. It's a Dark Souls game though, so it's part of a Let's Play's job to make you feel like a scrub. You know that one guy did drop loot and I never went and got it either when I died there. Embarrassing! It's, uh, come on. I'm, I need to learn, you guys. Oh, I mean, I mean, that look easy. Like, okay then, my friend. Come get me. I'm over here. I'm a tarnished. I don't know why I'm in your space, but I'm in your space. Oh, I hate. Hey, the Dark Souls game. 
You don't respect the tiniest of mobs. They will just murder you. <sighs> Dick, what are you doing with your life? Hmm. The embarrassment is setting in deep. Real deep. Okay, take 47. Uh, getting my ass whooped by basic trash mobs in Elden Ring. Why did I try and charge up an attack there? I don't fucking know. I saw his long swing and I was like, I'm gonna do a heavy attack. And I mean, it went as well as it should have went. I wonder if this thing attacks faster, not in two-handed. The answer seems like a no. Hey, it's the combo that has murdered me multiple times already. Use my last pot on two trash mobs. Technically a third if you count the wolf. Come on, buddy. You and me, we got a score to settle, and you whooped my ass like 30 times. I don't know why I didn't take the crit opportunity there while well, I had it. Do share with the shield bash, my friend. Always respect the range of the shield, or the range of the spear. That's how that's supposed to go when you do the rotation on them. That is not how it has been going. Can I get you without aggro and that other guy over there? Much appreciated. Okay. Just gonna rest the bonfire. We got no pots. I need to kill two more dudes to open a box. Then one more dude to open the other box. And then we get them out. These episodes are supposed to be 20 minutes long. We're already at 28 minutes, but you set a goal. That's what we're doing. We're going to the goal. Oh shit. Why did I not? Oh, when you know what? I didn't rest at the campfire. I, I activated it, but there was no rest to be had. Oh shit. He swings, bada, 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 swing, and he misses. How did that not kill me? Holy shit, the high frames. Oh. One down. You and me, shield guy. We got a history of, of you whooping my ass. Do something. Now, how about you don't do that move? Boop. You dead, bro. I know there's much better and easier ways to fight all these people, but here we are doing the things. Got our first dex weapon on the dex run. I'm hunting wabbits. And he dropped bolts. We don't need bolts, good sir. I need one of your... Technically, it's a dex run. I don't need any of your swords. Your armor would be nice, though. Some sort of something that I can put on my character's body. Okay, let's lock on to the right thing here. Ah, um, that was a jump instead of a dodge, so not professional. Well, now I'm at the mercy of his shield bash, which is terrifying. Why did I go for a second attack? 
pig. I need to wake up. I'm gonna blame it on not being awake. Or I could just blame it on the fact that I suck. However, Dark Souls games, as long as you learn, even very slowly, you get better and you win. So, uh, it's okay. It's okay, we're good. Everything's fine. 100% as expected. Hear me, buddy. You're the last mob I need to beat before I get my mount. Well, touche. Ow. Trying to be fancy here. This club does like a zero super armor break, it feels like. That to not stagger them at all. It's always surprising. Great sword and a flail. What does the flail take to equip? I think it's 18 decks. Damn! Well, it is a dex build, so maybe we put some points into some decks? Do I get to campfire or do I have to talk to her first? We have to talk to her first, okay. Hey, you're the lady that was on that horse. How'd you just appear here? That's kind of OP. Acted all intimidating and shit. Oh. Traveler from beyond the fog. I am Melina. Hey, it's my waifu. <laughs> Those memes are hilarious by not having a girlfriend yet. I offer you an accord. Have you heard of the finger maidens? Yes. They serve the two fingers, offering guidance and aid to the tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are maidenless. Yes, I am. I can play the role of maiden. I think turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. You need only take me with you to the. What if you refuse her? Then it's settled. Sir. Ah. And I bequeath to you this ring. ring. Spectral steed whistle. To traverse great distances. It will summon a spectral steed named Torrent. We love you, Torrent. Torrent has chosen you. Thank you. Treat him with respect. I will. You appreciate Shall it. I turn your runes. Let my hand rest upon you. Share them with me. Mm, I want 18 decks, not 11. Well, it's a start. It's a good start. Either way, everyone. Um, I do appreciate y'all stopping by for episode number one of a Dark Souls. It's just, it's just not a Dark Souls game, Dig. Like, what are you doing with your life? Welcome to... That's also the outro, not the intro. We're going to get this right. It's been a long time since I've done some Let's Play videos. So just bear with me here while we get back into the swing of things here. So it'll be like muscle memory and just be chugging these things out. Okay. Either way, everyone, that is the end of the episode. I really do appreciate you all stopping by and checking it out. Do all the YouTube things. Like, subscribe, comment, hit the bell notification. Yeah, I think that's the most of them. It's YouTube. Do all the stuff. You guys know it. It's in every video. And um, I will see you all in the next one. Dig big. Out! I made myself really big here. So I have no room to put the cards that I'm supposed to have. I keep myself small here. There's room for cards. If I make myself big, it's more personable. And that's better for outros. You can't ever win. 
I guess. <laughs>